ready to fully throttle it. <laughs> yeah. <hey. laughs> What it is, guys? Your boy Roll Jay Z. So we're outside on Sunday, fun day. So for today's video, man, we're gonna be testing out our bike. I'm really just testing out the gear for the 28 because I am having a problem with um getting this bike geared up right. But yeah, man, look, we got a fresh oil change. So um, shout out to my boy Phantom. Um, he put me on to running thicker oil because you can get more passes with it. Anything 10W30, um, it get milky within two to three passes. So we run this 10W, this 28. And, and and I know you guys are gonna be like, you're gonna lose power running thicker oil. I know, but I'd rather have more passes because me trying to switch the oil every two minutes, I get tiring. But yeah, man, shout out to Red Bear Garage because I've seen that it do make power if you do thicker oil, no, thinner oil. But you feel me? I like that thick stick stuff. But you know, that methanol, that methanol will get that oil milky. So yeah, man, we're gonna go ahead and switch to the hammer ca helmet cam and get this thing fired up. So let's get to it. Chirping. We back on it, we done cool down a little bit. Bro, this bitch died on three passes oh my thing came loose ah! so I need uh, I need a little piece of pink fill line because my fill thing keep coming up but we'll figure that out wobbly thing Wobbly thing. Alright, yeah, can you chop it down a little bit too? Yeah. What it is, guys, your boy Royal Jay Z. So, look, man, you remember when I first hit 90 miles per hour on my 28? We did was 91 miles per hour. We was averaging out 91, then we got it to 92. But once we switched the pipe to the FG pipe, we averaged to do 94 miles power. So we gained um, about 3 miles power because my average was really like 91. So, you know, big gain with the pipe. I am I'm happy with the pipe. You know, it did its job that day on Sunday. Um, today is Monday. Y'all might see this video on the 29th. 
it will see if I can edit it fast enough. It might come out at like four o'clock maybe, but I gotta see. But yeah, man, we did gain power with a FG aluminum pipe. I'm gonna give a shout out to him. You feel me? Nice little pipe, add a little bit more power. But now what we're gonna be doing is probably switching the gearing up a little bit because with that gearing, we're kind of tapped out at like 94. So yeah, man, shout out to FG for the pipe, man. Let's get to it, shirts. All right, so what we did was we took the 28 off the six inch frame and we put it on a regular little five inch GTS frame and it did 94. But the only reason we did 94 is because of the pipe. The pipe came loose. I tightened it up. I'm gonna let the motor cool down for a little bit and we're gonna get back on it. But yeah, man, that's why gearing is very important. So what I'm thinking about doing is probably turning this bike into an eight mile bike and go out of state like Arizona, Mesa, Arizona and race it out there. Because as of right now, this motor like the five inch frame better or i could probably convert this into a five inch frame but i gotta really look into it and see how hard it is or if anything put a scrub brake have gt's like what a scrub brake or i could probably rework the brakes but i gotta really like look into it but yeah man we did 94 miles per hour but the pipe came loose so yeah man Hey, what that is, man? That ain't no FG pipe. <laughs> Thank you, Rob, bro. Yeah, <laughs> well, thank you, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> <Good job>. <laughs> <laughs> what it do, flight crew? FTC. FTC! <laughs> 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 